I couldn't sleep. Things were bad, and they were only gonna get worse. The truth was gonna come out sooner or later. And then we were gonna have Falcone after us along with the Chinese and Vinci. This wasn't how I imagined it when we were starting out. I dreamed of money, cars, women, respect, freedom. I guess I ended up getting all that, more or less. But along with it came prison, living in constant fear, and the blood of my friends. I ducked it as long as I could, but it was finally catching up with me. It was all just a matter of time. Yeah, hello. Vito. Yeah, it's Eddie. Uh, listen, I need you to... Let me guess. You need me to come by right away, and I should bring a gun. For once, I don't. <laughs> yeah, Carlo wants to see you over at the planetarium. Did he say what it was about? Nope. Uh, better head over there now, though. I uh, don't want to keep the man waiting. <laughs> yeah, see you, Vito. Mr. Scaletta, can you get in, please? Hey, old man. What are you doing back? Just get in the damn car. Now. And you are... This is our friend, Mr. Chu. All right, so what the hell's going on? What is this? This is about you. You fucked up good, didn't you? Started a fucking war. Got no idea what you're talking about. Don't fuck with me, boy. I probably forgotten more about this business than you'll ever learn. Half our guys are dead, half of Mr. Chu's guys are dead, and now the feds are breathing down everybody's necks. Because of you. Leo, listen. You listen. If it wasn't for me, you would have already been taken care of. So you're gonna listen to what I have to say, and you're gonna listen good. What you did in Chinatown. That was because of that cocksucker Henry, right? You know who he was working for when he died? You mean when he was butchered? He was working for the feds. He was a fucking rat. That's why Mr. Chu's people did what they did. And that's why the feds are going after Carlo now. But I don't forget my friends, Vito. You did for me, so I did for you. I called in a few favors. Got you one chance to make this right. Okay, I'm listening. You're gonna get rid of Carlo. Do us all a favor. And if I refuse? You die. Frank and the rest of the commission want you dead. So does Mr. Chu. And to top it all off, you vouched for a rat. You think Carlo's gonna let that slide? You're a dead man walking. <sighs> when? Now. Every minute we wait is another minute we give to the feds. He's holed up at that observatory of his. You know, something's up. Carlo Falcone is a lot of things, but stupid ain't one of them. All right. Stop the car. Remember, kid, this is your last chance. Yo, get out.
Hey, fellas. Hey, Vito. The boss wants to see you. Good. I want to see him, too. One, uh, one thing, though, Vito. I gotta take your gun. Yeah, all right. Here you go.
face so I can blow it off. This is who they send? This is an insult. What'd they tell you, Vito? Take care of me and all's forgiven? You really think they're just gonna let you walk after everything you did? Then again, chumps like you never do think about the big picture. But your buddy Joe understands, don't you, Joe? What the fuck is this? I could ask you the same question. Loyalty's a funny thing, huh, Vito? No such thing as friendship in this business. Didn't your old pal Leo teach you that while you're sucking his cock back in the can? <laughs> you're just a fucking pawn, Vito. It's all you ever were. When are you gonna realize Joe, that? Joe, you just gotta trust me. You think I give a shit about the feds? All those tired old fucks on the commission? They're using you, Vito. Just like Clemente used you. Just like I used you. Just like that rat fuck Henry used you. You vouch for that piece of shit. Brought him into my house. And now, you dumb fuck, you're gonna pay for it. Now, Joe. Hey. If you're gonna pull that trigger, do it already. What are you waiting for? Vito. Let's shoot this cocksucker. Remember what we talked On about, three. Joe. You're gonna throw One. all that away? Do it! Two. Now! God damn it, somebody kill these two psychos! You really are insane, aren't you? I can enjoy watching you die. Come on already! There's only two of them! You know something, Carlo? For the last ten years, all I'd done was kill. I killed for my country. I killed for my family. I killed anybody that got in my way. But this one... This one's for me. Fuck. Fucking prick. I sure as hell hope you know what you're doing here. Don't worry, I took care of it. You'll see. So, uh, what was he talking about back there? Nothing. He made me an offer, that's all. Yeah, I figured out that much. What kind of offer? He wanted me to whack you. Said he'd make me a capo. Give me my own crew. You know, pretty much everything I ever wanted. Yeah? So why the hell didn't you do it? Remember that five bucks you owe me? What the hell is this? It's all right, Joe. Is it done? It's done. All right, then. Looks like a celebration is in order. Come on. Let's head to the cat house. Sounds good to me. Come with me, Vito. There's more we need to talk about. All right, we'll see you over there. All right. So what's the big secret? Hey, 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 what the hell's going on? Where are they taking Joe? Sorry, kid. Joe wasn't part of our deal. 